Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new, hello and welcome. My name's Katie and welcome to my channel. I do high protein related videos and I'm documenting my weight loss journey. So feel free to check out my channel and if you like what you see then don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Apologies if you can hear Louie in the background. Uh, I need to film this video today because I want to get it up. Uh, and basically it's another small business unboxing. It's for a lovely girl who owns Geek Girl on Wheels and she is from Canada. So this box took a little while to get here. So it's just this little box here. Uh, also, she has chosen me to be a rep for Geek Girl on Wheels um, boxes. So if you'd like to support this small business and order anything from her shop, I'm gonna all link everything in the description below. Um, my discount code will be here, it's Magical World. So yeah, if you'd like to see what is in this whoop, little box, then keep on watching. This is from the lovely Geek Girl on Wheels shop. She is a lovely small business. Uh, she has a disability, so she can find it a bit difficult doing her work, but she loves it so much that she it won't. It, her disability won't stop her working, basically. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I've got a little thank you card that she put in the box. Um, and yeah, it just says uh, your your purchase is so much more than just a number. It's a dance. It's a little happy dance. Your purchase helps pay for a safe apartment to live in, light and heat. You're helping a disabled artist to find pride in herself. There's no corporate yachts or million dollar bonuses for CEOs. Just a woman doing silly little dance on wheels. And then I think she's changed the link to her shop, but I'm going to put all the links in the description below. Also to her social media, so you can see the kind of things she does. So yeah, that's the little cute card. And then it just says, thanks for joining the crazy train. Um, and I hope you enjoy. So I've got this little box. I believe it's a Luna themed box. So I'm going to go ahead and open it and I shall show you what she's got inside. So as I said, I believe this is a, the Luna themed box. Uh, she did send this out quite a while ago, but obviously due to it coming all the way from Canada to the UK and post is just ridiculous at the moment. It took a little while to get it. So I'm one of the last reps to get my box. Um, so yeah, let's just get ahead and open it. We've got a spoiler card. So here we are. Here is what is in this little lovely box. So we have got a lovely washi tape. So this is, I think it's got the quibbler on. I hope open my camera focuses, I've changed the settings. But yeah, this is a lovely washi tape. It's such a pretty colour as well. And yeah, it's got the Spectrospex, quibbler, and other little bits and pieces that relate to the lovely Luna Lovegood. So that will definitely be going in my little creative box to use. Oh, I love this. Um, as you can all know, if you watch my magical videos, I love my magical pins. And obviously with Luna Lovegood, she was loves the festivals. So yeah, a beautiful, cute festival pin. She also does plush festivals. I don't know if they're sold out already, but they are so cute and I would love one, but I can't afford to ship in. Um, but yeah, apology if you can hear Louis in the background, he's playing with some cards, like my pack of cards. Uh, so yeah, that is a very cute festival pin. So we have got a Gryffindor patch because I am a Gryffindor. I actually have this patch already on my denim jacket, but I'm going to obviously use it. <laughs> uh, so yeah, it's just the standard Gryffindor patch. It's an iron-on one, I think, but the ones I used are, you can sew them on as well, just in case. So yeah, I've got a lovely Gryffindor patch. So I think this is part of her little stationery range. So she's got a little pa big paper clip and it's got the 
Funko version of Luna on top, which is very, very cute. It's a rubber, like, topper for a pin, a uh, paper, uh, like, planner clip. It says at the bottom, I've just seen. Uh, so, yeah, that will come in handy for clipping things together. So, what have we got in here? Oh, we've got a little, like, potion ingredient. I'm hoping this comes up. Uh, let me see. It's not focusing. Let me see if I can get it to focus. So I'm going to try and take a closer image of this. Uh, so, it's basically a potion ingredient and it's Thestral hair. And obviously we know that Luna was really into the Thestrals and would look after them and stuff. So this says, a hair taken from the tail of a Thestral can be used as a wand core. So that's good to know, obviously <laughs> using Thestral hair in a wand, that would be really, really cool. And that's going to look really cool on my potion shelf because I don't have anything potion ingredient wise relating to a Thestral and yeah uh, the cork is also covered in like a gold wax as well so it's not going to just pop open so yeah and that is the festival hair that's gonna that's really cool actually i really like that expecting that <laughs> so we've got some little stickers in here we've got a Luna chocolate frog sticker which is the iconic picture of Luna Lovegood love that love collecting stickers obviously we've got the oh it's a magnet <laughs> a free Dobby magnet because obviously she was uh, close with uh, she was kind of close with Dobby before he died um so she is very kind to the elves and yeah I'll stick that on my fridge in a minute another sticker with a rabbit with spectra specs on or a hair sticker. if you want to look at it that way uh because i'll see her i think her patronus is a hair am i right sticker. i think that's right but yeah that's a lovely cute sticker and got a little postcard or card at the end of this little box which is an iconic uh card for luna it's obviously a beautiful spectra specs and then the iconic quote don't worry you're just as sane as i am and that is great artwork as well really really like that really simple but really effective so yeah just have a quick look at the little spoiler card just to make sure we've got everything so this was obviously the Luna Lovegood box. She is doing other character themed boxes throughout the rest of the year. So we've got Luna Lovegood mini print, same as me. So that's this one. Really loved how simple the artwork is, but it looks really effective. So I'm gonna have to find a place to put that on my shelves. We've got the Thestral hair ingredient or you would have got a necklace but i'm really happy i've got the ingredient actually because that's going to look really cool on my potion shelf uh also we got can't pick it up off the side and obviously normally i would uh film against my magical background but because i've got louis with me on my own i need to be able to watch him so next is the two stickers really really cool stickers love those so i'll be going in my sticker collection um so we've got the Dobby magnet, which feels really good quality. I'm going to go quickly test it on the fridge. Yeah. Definitely works. You can see it just there. And yeah, really good quality magnet. Loved it. Um, I don't have much Dobby merch, but yeah. That's going to look really cool and make my start making my fridge look a little bit more magical. Uh, so Dobby Magnet, uh, we've got the uh, Quibbler washi tape, 
which is really really cool i've got a little collection of washi tapes going on which i use sometimes in my like witchy journaling kind of thing so yeah that's that and then we've got the festival enamel pin and then are these two extras I think these two things might have been a little bit extra because I've become a rep for Geek Girl on Wheels. So that was very, very kind of her. So obviously my lovely patch, which I get to use. And the... Yeah, this is... I think it's an extra. But, yeah, so that's the little, little spoiler card that she puts in the box. So this was the Luna box, I believe... The next one might be Ron, Ron Weasley, I think. I'm not sure, but you'll be able to see it on her website, which I'm going to link in the description. And I'm going to put a social media in there just so you can go follow her and see what she's doing. And yeah, so this was my lovely first box from Geek Girl on Wheels. If you did enjoy this kind of video, please don't forget to leave a like. And if you're new, I'd really appreciate you hitting the subscribe button and yeah so i'm hoping i can keep carrying on doing these little uh, unboxings for geek girl on wheels they do take a little bit longer to get here but they will be on my channel hopefully and if you were interested on using my discount code it'll be in the description and it'll be here magical world and it'll get you i think it's 10 percent off her shop so yeah i'd really recommend going to check her out she's such an amazing person really kind really caring really passionate about what she does and loves supporting other small businesses as well like using other the other ones in her boxes so yeah i'd really recommend checking her out and yeah so i'm going to leave it there and i shall speak to you soon in another video so take care guys bye